Alright, welcome to uh, a property that was once owned by Poppy Bennington, a fictional character who was, he was our grandfather, the character Poppy Bennington. Uh, Corn Emick. Jason London. I'm playing Pollux. I'm Caster. And uh, we are doing a show called Blackwater Blues, which is a murder mystery show. Back over here behind us is what we call Blackwater Pond. Uh, which later on I'll take you on a little tour of. Mainly right now, what we're doing is uh, is pulling together this project, which we've been in pre-production on for how long now? About, about <laughs> two months. About two months. Two, months yeah, two, yeah, two, three months. Uh, so uh, we're, we're geared up to go. We have a great crew involved, and uh, a bit of the backstory: our characters, whose father was um, uh, a major biker gang. Uh, um, Hannibal's, which was yeah. a, a fictional motorcycle club, and he, he passed away in our youth, and our mom remarried a, uh, a local mobster named Big Tuna. Now, um, Big Tuna also was uh, was doing a lot of nefarious deals around this fictional town of Black. And she was also doing like she was doing a lot of like say like the paperwork, like a lot of the she knew stuff that she maybe wasn't supposed to know. So. Exactly, yeah. exactly, and and as the the bookkeeper, you could call her, uh, she she was privy to all of that information, and at a certain point, she was either killed or disappeared, and so she just she disappeared off the planet, and uh, you know we decided to find out what happened. Exactly, yeah. and and now uh, in in present time, after our two characters went to jail for a while, after we going were, a little crazy, we went a little nutty <laughs> after mom disappeared. <laughs> But, but now, in, in present time, we get out and our, and our grandfather passes away and leaves us a list of clues uh, of, of, of locations or things which, uh, which will guide us to the mystery of, of, of what happened to our mother. Um, that's, yeah, he leaves us enough information that it's not so much information that we would get ourselves killed, but it's enough that we can try to figure out what happened without getting uh, too into the, the mix. And what's great about the show is that you know, we go from sort of hint to clue to clue to clue, and no one's out of the woods. Everyone seems a little bit uh, mysterious. Everyone seems to know a little something that they shouldn't know, and why aren't they letting us know the truth, right? So that's kind of our journey a little bit, right? Yeah, exactly. So you got these two, like, hillbillies that are, like, trying to, you know, solve their mom's murder and, uh, or disappearance, I guess I should say. One of the two. Uh, there's a lot of, and there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of sort of underlying uh, layers to the onion uh, that are going on. There's always, we're always being watched, and you don't know who we're being watched by. Um, there's, there's, there's things that are happening that um, I guess we stir up a little. Uh, we stir that we the, the, stir up the hornet's the, nest. The hornet's nest. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty much what happens. And so once that starts happening, the the it just snowballs and. Um, Pilot really leads into like a great, uh, a great season on a show or a series because uh, it just it leaves you hanging in the most beautiful way, and uh, because you, it's one of those things of a, like a whodunit and also like seriously like whodunit like what's the trip? You know? Exactly, yeah. exactly. So so what we're doing here is is you know we want to shoot what's called a pilot presentation. We want to film a number of scenes from the script, put it all together so that it tells the overall story, uh, and, and this will push us over the edge in, in terms of being able to get this on air. But uh, but you know the, the locations we have, which I'll I'll take you to uh, oh, later got, on. Oh. Great great locations, great it's people. Literally the like the, the the perfect place to film a, a series is, is on, the, on the bayou down here. Sunsets are unbelievable. The the swamps are incredible. The cypress trees, the oaks, the, the, the old oaks, yeah. the, the, you know, all of that. It's just, we've got uh, so many visuals that are incredible here that you can't get in uh, California or whatever. Out there you get a lot of dirt and desert and things like that, which are great, but here you just get, you just get, you get water. Exactly. You, know, you get water. And that's what, uh, you know, that's what we love about down here. So and, it's, uh, it's also the history, sorry about Yeah, yeah, no, no, go the, for it. The history of, of where we're coming from, um, you know, there's a long history of uh, sort of a, a, a Dixie Mafia. And uh, we're sort of playing off of that whole idea of that, like, 
well, you, we imagine Chicago and Detroit and New York City and those gangsters or whatever. There's these guys down here. These, those people up there had nothing on these guys. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and so we're sort of playing on that a little bit. And, and uh, you know, it's one of those things that's like you don't want to dip your finger too uh, deep into the pot because when you do, even to this very day, you get burned. Yeah, <laughs> that's why they're called the. Yeah. Oh, the Gulf yeah. Coast Mafia. Yeah, Gulf yeah. Coast Mafia. Uh, <clears throat> so, yes, yeah, so that, that that's the overall gist of the story. You'll get to know a little bit more about it when I show you around some of the locations. Uh, and eventually, I'll, you, you, you get to meet some of the, the cast of characters uh, Amazing in it. Amazing people. But, but I think that, uh, you know, we make this thing go right. We, you know, we'll be, we'll be on, on set filming uh, uh, the pilot presentation uh, be, before the end of the month. Let's make it happen. All right, we're going to do it. <laughs>